what I'm thinking is we take this and we do this. That's a pretty classic idea, but I've only seen one video of a person do this, so uh, I'll just do it anyway. So what I'm gonna do is put this monstrosity on my head while also not trying to get expelled from school because uh, that, 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 that doesn't really work around here. I mean, I don't think my parents would be too pleased to find me expelled for um, putting a weaponized propeller hat on my head and bringing it to school. So I'll either use this thing if I'm dumb enough, which I mean, I probably am because I mean, it's this video or putting this thing on my head. I know it looks small, but uh, it's loud. It'll get the attention of a lot of people and it'll still chop some fingers off so we can have some fun. And on doing is putting the motor hot glued on my head or something like that. Um, my receiver, which I probably have not plugged this in correctly, a um, ESC, which I also probably have not plugged in correctly, and a um, 2200 milliamp hour 3S, uh, which I hope doesn't explode on the back of my head because that kind of hurt a little and maybe hurt some other people, so that's that's not good. Um, that's what I have right now. That's what I think I'll do. Unless I just want to strap this beast on here and just walk through the neighborhood. I don't really feel like getting expelled in eighth grade. Well, that's part one. I kind of want to keep these uh, videos short and sweet, so I'm just going to end it there. The next video, it's going to have me probably hot gluing all that stuff down that could explode on the back of my head or like burn my hair off uh, severe brain damage you know all the all the good stuff and um, I think that's it running through school with a uh, motorized propeller hat couldn't get any better than that